Yeah, everything is good, guys. Good. Yeah. So, yeah, one mistake is there. Why it's giving the uh, uh, like mm, we did not give in where we need to convert, right? Where where we want? What is that? We did not give in what is that location. I want to generate this image in the current location, right? Come on, people, please respond, everybody. Yes, yes sir. So what we will give it now? Now, one space we will give and a dot jar, sorry, dot, dot we will give. Dot means what? I want to specify this image in the current directory only. Current, now, now I'm, now I'm entering. See, it's started to converting, right? It's a started, means it's con converted, right? It's converted. What is that build jar? 17 MB, right? First, what is that? From open JDK one point and volume location it's given and expose, expose 8080 and using cache and step four is having, what is that? Adding target folder. This is the alias name and this one, whatever things we given in the file, those things is, Based on those things only, this image is created now. Five uh, entry point is this one, Java, Java jar, and uh, this one only, right? Come on, people. Yes. Yes, yeah. Thank so, you. yeah. So now here, just increase one more thing here. Dot because if we not give it is dot, right? After the next step, if you want to check, right? If you want to check, right? What is that? Our if you want to check check existing images, right? Images, then what is the command? Just now here, just give what is a Docker, Docker, Docker image, 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 LS means list. If you want to check, right? So if you want to check, see 15 hours, 15 hours, four weeks, don't bother about just 15 second echo, what is that one created, created, right? 50 second ago, what is that latest spring boot docker? This image is created or not? Come on, don't bother about that. This one is yes. I created, this, this, these things I created previously. Last time. Yeah, so this repository, this is the repository tags and image ID and created and a size. So 50, 58 second ago, right? 58 second ago, which one we created? Spring Boot, Docker only we created or not? Come on. Yes, yes Spring Boot. Right? So now. Yes. Yeah. So if you want to check, right? If you want to check, right? Check, check. Exist, existed, existed, existed image. Existed image. Sorry. So, uh, existed Docker image. So we need to use what is that? This is the command. We need what is that? Use this command. Docker image ls. Right. So list. After then what? If you want to run right. If you want to run our image right. If you want to run this image right. How you can? So this is the latest only, right? Latest tag is the latest, okay? 58 seconds. So I want to run this one, okay? So I will give this name. So how we can run, how we can run? Don't worry, still I'm running in the local only. Still I did not push in the central repository. Means what is the Docker Hub? I'll push it, that one also I will push. Okay, so how, how, how we can run it now? Let's run, run image. Let's run what is that image? This is the important. Run image, right? Run image. How we can run it? How we can run it now? We need to give what is that Docker? Docker run command. After then, what is that? Hyphen P. Hyphen P, right? After then, what is that? On which port number? On which port number our? 8080, 80, right? 8080. After then, what is the image name we given? What is the image name we given? Spring Boot. Spring, Spring Boot. Spring Boot. Docker, right? We given this name now? Come on. Yes. Oh, yes. So by default, this port number. Hey, I don't want to run my application on this. What is that? 
the whatever the our project port number is there i want to specify my port number then what we will do it now then we will mask this port number we will mask this port number yes. how we can mask it like this okay so here we will give i want to run what is a 9090 port number and on this one only right so like this we will mask the port number right like this we will mask the port number so now let's run it this one also let's run this command so what is the command docker docker run, run docker run hyphen after p. then what is that hyphen hyphen p. p after then what is that what is the port number 8080 right and, and uh, what is the what is the image name is spring boot docker right so spring boot docker right spring boot docker okay after then what is that i want to run what is that on my port number so just what is that 9090 and that is that's it okay so what is that what we will do it now hit enter hit enter Hey, what is the problem? It's giving space. Is in a space you did space. Space. zero after. Yeah, yeah, correct. Now hit it. It's it's a starting now. Yeah, our application is starting now. Wait. Yeah, it's up now, friends. Okay, if you want to check on the browser, now come here. Now this is the eight zero. If we run also now, it will not work. See, uh, now it's saying that what is that? This is because we changed because we changed the port number, right? So nine zero nine zero. Now here. Oh no so what is the whole now this is not running in the local now nah? this is not running in the local we need to give what is that ip address of our mm. doc ip address of our docker so what is the ip address now friends what is yes. the ip address one nine one zero one nine two Yeah, now hit it. See, we are getting the result or not? Same result. Welcome to RK technology. Yeah. Right? After converting in the image, yeah. so we are getting the same things or not, friends? Come on. Yes, sir. Yes. Means, means, means we converted the image. I want to push this image inside that what? I want to push this image inside that what now, friends? What now? Where? Mm -hmm. In the in the repository right in the in the github repository right here itself only in this repository now this repository is empty right this repository is empty nothing is there now come on yes yeah so what is the command of pushing that the docker only giving see this this is only right come on this is the command to push our what is that our our image in the repository this is the what is that uh, username plus what is that repository name and what is that target name is the latest only we will take right so now next one is what is that how we can it how we can do it now but before pushing these things right first we need to log in right log in then we can because until unless it be not log in from the uh, local it will not work so so what is the command for oh, login no. now hey, what is the login command for, uh, for that now? What is the login command for that now? Let's understand that one also. Yeah, so now, so I want to push, right? I want to push in the, this image in the Docker, right? I want to push this image in the Docker 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 hub right docker hub hub push and a pull push and a pull i'm going to perform this operation friends right i'm going to perform what is that these operations 
right i'm going to perform see till now the things is completed right but these things i'm going to pull push inside that repository so i'm going to perform this operation so everyone is ready for seeing this now yes sir yeah yeah so now yeah so docker hub right in the docker hub i want to push it so first what we need to do log into docker account first what we need to do now okay. we need to log in docker account log in docker account <laughs> login docker account right login docker account so what is the command what is the command docker docker login docker login now come on the here control c i'm stopping the application right so here what i'm going to do now docker docker login right uh, whenever we will click it now see this what we are getting now username it's asking now come on yes yes yeah yes. so log in that command what is my username what is the my username see this here ravi khan tripathi is my username right so r a v i k a n t t r i p a t h i now hit it now it's asking the password don't worry i'll not give the password right you guys can create your own username and password and you can do so i'm putting my password now hit it so now i entered my password login succeeded right what messages we are getting now login succeeded now after putting that username and password come on yes yes yeah so after putting this command what is that it will ask username username and password after password putting that what you will get if everything is then then you will get what is the login succeeded login succeeded after getting the login succeeded what we need to do go inside that what is that see this already command is giving right already this one is giving how we can push our what is that image in the docker image in the docker we need to use what is that we need to use what is that this command plus what is that target is what is that target is latest l l a t e s t na correct right yeah so we need to run this command right docker push Ravi Kant Tripathi plus repository and latest. Now hit it. Uh, what is this? An image does not exist locally with the tag. Okay. So uh, sorry for that. It's my mistake only, right? But RK repository only. Latest only. I want to push right. Hey, sorry, sorry, sorry. First, before before doing this, what we need to do? What we need to do? Come here. First, before doing that, what we need to do? We need to create first link. First link. We need to create first link between what is that? Between what is that? Oh. Image to what is that? Docker repository, right? First, we need to. create what is that link then we can able to push it so what is that how we can create the link now friends how we can create the link now i'll tell okay now this one first this one delete it right because after then these things will come now delete okay now we need to create link how we can create the link now how we can create the link now docker docker tag right docker tag then what is that what is the image name friends spring spring boot what is that docker was there right yes, docker 
Docker, right? Think about Docker. Docker, Docker. After then, what we need to give? After then, we need to give what is that? Ravi Kant username. Ravi Kant T R I P A T H I slash R K. Because we created the R K R K repository only, right? Now That's then, good. latest. latest right latest okay we need to run this command right we need to run this command so now come here paste this command now we created the link right we created the link between what is that container to what is that container to repo 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 use means what is that link means what is that tag itself only right tag only yeah. tag only after then what we need to do now come here and uh, copy this one now here paste it make this one as what is that latest latest now hit it see now it's started to what is that putting preparing now it's it's the taking time wait Based on the size is taking time. In net speed is slow now. Yeah, one is pushed. These are still mounting now. Based on the size, it will take time, friends. Okay. Yeah, everything is pushed inside that, right? So now, next step, what is that? Push, push into, push into what is that? Docker Hub. Docker Hub. What is that? latest latest this is the command right this is the command now if you want to uh, now come inside that now here it, this is the empty now i'm refreshing now friends see now in this time latest one is came or now a few second ago this repository content, what is that one tag it's showing or not, friends? Come on, yeah. Mm? Please respond, everybody. Yes, mm? yes, yes, yes. Means what is that? Yes. It's uh, we placed uh, it, right? We placed inside that what? Yes. We placed inside that what is that repository? That is called what is that repository? This is that is called what tags. is tags, right? Tags. Now come. Yeah come inside my explanation whatever i explained now friends okay so what i said now if we are putting that image inside that repository what we are saying now tags we are saying right see the uh, docker docker concept only i'm explaining right and the push commands and everything how to create the images and all those things now this step we completed this step we com completed right Later now if how how we can pull right how we can pull let's understand how we can pull these images from the our local again right come on yeah uh, yeah our okay. local uh, in our local right so just nothing nothing much friends right 
so already see this one okay already in our local it is there okay let's pull a different image right this different one because yesterday this one i already this one 15 hours ago right i'm pushing this code now okay because what is the use already we uh, put now let's pull different one now in this time right come on i'm i'm going yeah. to pull, pull different one friends okay don't worry, bother about that okay so because same things why we will pull it okay let's uh, pull different repository sorry different image okay so how we can pull it now now okay. means i'm going to perform these operation right these operation yeah okay so come here yeah so here what is that pull pull existed existed image 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 from what is that from from docker from docker to what is that to local 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 right local local right what is the command now what is the command now friends to pulling that for that our docker only our docker only is giving right so here what is that click on the repository and public view is there now click on that yeah click on that so here one url is sorry here command is there copy that command and come on the come on what is that our docker pull repository itself only right and what is that colon latest now hit it and hit enter see already see latest pulling from the ravikant repository this is the id number status image is up to date from the ravikant ravikant latest okay docker io repository latest right it's a uh, now it's came in our what local it's came again that that images came again in our what is that local so what is the command now now this is command right docker and open yeah so Less. so if you want to check if you want to check what is that what is the docker run docker space run docker, docker space image ls 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 right ls so what is that which one is there id it was showing that right so this second one second one no second one is, no this is not pulling that right so this one uh, this this is the repository yeah, right okay. Ravi repository this one only this one yeah. only, right the modification time itself the first time when i push the inside that that time is giving right so this repository again we pull um, uh, we took in the local right so this is these things is there right using the window if we are performing the docker dockerization operation in our application friends okay so these things is there after then what we need to do if you are logging out so what is that docker docker log out docker log out now remove lo logging right okay logged out removing log out now now exist now exist oh exit exit right so like this like this using the spring right how much we are performing using spring boot dockerization i completed friends okay i completed now so everybody is like comfortable with this session friends yes sir yes sir yeah so so don't worry in uh, whenever i will explain what is that aws sorry devops in that like the uh, little bit different concept will come but how much need in the spring boot application right that much i explained friends okay yes sir yeah yeah so now let's stop our session tomorrow we will understand what is that uh cs yeah, sorry yeah yeah i have some issue can you tell me 
in a sonar pictures uh, some refractor method is there so how to solve that one because here multiple efg used yes yeah, sorry in sonar fixes i'm not in application you know, yeah sonar application sonar fixes sonar fixes uh. yeah in refractor is coming so how yeah. to solve that one you want to set the uh, sonar environment in in your application or like uh, sonar effector i'm not getting your point what is really needed sonar lint i already set up i uh. want to fix that okay you want to fix yeah matlab yeah. means uh, in your application right sonar sonar bug is came when you ran that sonar like some our sonar is given some error right Bugs are given yes. to you. You want to fix those bugs? Yes, some bugs are fixed, but one bug I did not fix it. Refractor method is coming. Refractor method. You need to check it, right? Yes. Without checking that, I can't tell, right? Directly in that, like yes. uh, in the sonar cube, right? So many things will come. Okay, based on that, so many multiple uh, like things will be there. Oh, which one is giving the problem and why you are getting those things i don't know na because that is the yeah are you can you, yeah refactor and all those things that is the secondary thing you can under like uh, collaborate with your team member right you can ask with those people are right uh, but if if possibility is there i will share the zoom meeting right we will connect uh, on the zoom meeting then i can tell like directly because sonar sonar things is not a smallest things okay that is the big task so don't worry i'll i'll tell i am experienced on that also but the thing is without seeing that i can't tell i can send you whatsapp but in system i can't log in yeah okay send the you uh, uh, first send the error and all those things by seeing that if i if i get to know that i will tell okay okay or stop the recording yeah